Today, I'm gonna to show you how to use the Clerk waitlist component, which lets you easily gather email addresses when you're in the beginning phases of building an application. I have a demo project on screen that I'm actively building. And then one of the to-do items I have is to add a waitlist form right where this text is here. Now, before I can use the waitlist component from Clerk, I have to enable waitlist mode. So inside of the Clerk dashboard, I have my Quillmate project open, which corresponds with the demo we just saw. I'm gonna to go to the configure tab. I'm gonna to go to restrictions. And then by default, public will be enabled. We're gonna change this to waitlist and then go ahead and click save. Now I have the code for that homepage open inside of my editor. And then line one is where my imports are from the at clerk forward slash next.js SDK. Every SDK is gonna be a little bit different. So check our docs if you're using something different, but I'm gonna open or I'm gonna import the waitlist component from here. And then I'm going to replace the text here where it says add waitlist form here with my waitlist component and simply close off the tag. Back in my application, I have the waitlist form that has automatically been rendered. Let's go ahead and add an email address just to demonstrate this, brian plus waitlist at clerk.dev. And I'll go ahead and click join the waitlist. Now back in the clerk dashboard, you might've missed this, but when we enabled waitlist mode, there's a new tab that appears up top here that says waitlist. I can click in this and then I can see all of the people who have actually joined my waitlist. And when I'm ready to invite them into the application test, I can click these little three dots on the right and click invite, or if I don't want to see them, I'll click deny. And when I click invite, this user is going to receive an email stating that they're welcome to come over to the application, sign up and start testing and providing feedback. Now the waitlist feature from Clerk is powerful in and of itself, but it can actually be integrated with loops to create a complete communication loop with your customers. And if you wanna learn how to build that integration, I'm gonna leave a link down below that links to an article that I wrote to describe this entire process and how you can actually do this, as well as the benefits that come along with integrating Clerk and loops together.